saw my last video, you see I did a pretty epic haul in Vegas and the star buy has to be the Sephora Give Me More Lip sort of Sephora favourite set. This is just unbelievable value and so much choice in here. It's $59 which is which is about £40 which for the full set is absolutely amazing and it is $192 worth of value. So it's basically just a great way to sample a lip product. So I will go through these and swatch them as I'm going through. So when you open it up it looks like this. You have your 17 products here. I'm not sure if they've stuck them in any particular order. I think they've done it by colour so they're your reds, they're more of your movies and natural colours. They're more of your sort of intense colours, I'm guessing, and these are more of your pinks. Sorry. To be fair, to get these out, you pretty much need to take this whole plastic thing out and pop them from the back because there's not much giveaway to sort of get your nails through, so to pop it out from the back is probably the easiest thing. Okay, first up is the Hourglass Lip Gloss, and this is one gram in weight or 0.03 ounces, and the colour of this is Icon. This is just so adorable. So it just looks like that. It's got one of those little spongy spoolies. I've actually got stains on my hand from the other night of swatching these because I have washed my hands, I've scrubbed my hands, they just do not come off. So this is just a very, very pigmented gloss and it just looks like that. It's absolutely stunning and goes on so smooth. Really, really like this. It's so cute for your handbag. Okay, next up is the Laura Mercier Cream Smooth Lip Colour in Red and More. And this is 2.5 grams or 0.09 ounces. And this is just adorable again, and this is another bright red. I love this little lipstick. And that's that colour there. Okay, next up is the Kat Von D Everlasting Lipstick, Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Outlaw. And this is 3 mils or 0.10 fluid ounces. I think this is what stained my hands the most. That just goes on so nice. It's such a gorgeous sort of, it's not quite a lip gloss, it is very sort of liquid lipstick. As it's described. And as you can see, they're slightly different enough to justify all three of them. Okay, next is the Sephora Collection Rouge Infusion, and this is 2 mils or 0.068 fluid ounces. Ooh, it just pops out. And again, it's like another... This is more sheer than the others, but still gives them quite an intense colour, so that is that colour there. And it is more... It's weird. It's, it looked kind of browny at first, but it is more like a, a rosy red. It looks brown at first, but yeah, more of a natural, rosy kind of red, but that'd be like a nice stain on the lips. Next we have the OCC Lip Tart in Black Dahlia, and this is a 2.5ml tube. I've always wanted to try one of these, so I'm so happy there's one in the box. So it just looks like that, and then obviously with the lip brush. Oh, that's beautiful. It just looks like that there, so I imagine you could probably build this up really dark or sheer it out quite a bit. But it's an absolute gorgeous plum. Okay, this is the Tarte Lip Surgeon's Lip Tint, which is one gram and it is in the colour Flush. So this is one of the, you know, this is like one of the crayon kind of applicators. So this is extremely sheer, but it is again the same kind of intense dark berries. That'll look really nice if you're a bit scared of the bold colours, you can sheer it out with this. Oh, just sorry, that wasn't the, um, that was a different one. This is the Lip Surgeon's Lip Tint in Moody. And I've always wanted to try one of these. This is the Fresh Sugarberry Tinted Lip Treatment, and it is 2.2 grams or 0 0.08 ounces. I'm guessing, yeah, berry is the flavour of this one. So it's got SPF 15 as well, and it is just a little tinted lip balm. It's very sheer like the one just before, but it's a lot more pink or oh, berry coloured as it is. That feels absolutely lovely, so a tinted lip balm. This is the Boxum Mini Full Body Lipstick in Menace, and this is 1.3 grams. It's just so cute. It looks like this. Oh, that's beautiful. So it's again, it's like a really intense berry. I really, really like it so far how they're all different shades. There's not like the same colour twice. They're either the dark version or the sheer version, but they're all different kind of shades. Okay, this is the Bites Beauty Luminous Cream Lipstick in Palomino, and it is two grams. Oh, it's so cute again. Ooh, wow, that's a beautiful colour. So there you go, that's the more intense pink. That's absolutely stunning. This is the Benefit Hydrating Tinted Lip Balm in Posy, which is the called Posy Balm. In fact, you do not get much of that at all. In fact, that is all you get, that one little bit there, so that's a bit naff. And that just looks like that is extremely, extremely sheer. So 
let's just see how moisturising it is then. And again, another product that I really want to try, this is the Too Faced Melted Liquefied Longwear Lipstick and this is 5 ml. this is Melted Fuchsia. So obviously this is the hot pink section of the box. So it's just one of those sponge applicators like that. I've already, it's white when you get it, obviously I've already tried this out. And, ooh, wow. That is really, really intense, I cannot wait to try that one. And this is the one I got confused with before. This is the Tarte Lip Surgeon's Power Pigment in Flush. Which just looks like that. Oh, that's nice. More of a, a vibrant berry than the previous pinks. So that's really, really nice, that. I'm running out of hand space. And then you get a lip pencil, which I think is quite cool because all the rest of the lip products. And this is a nude colour, so you could probably wear this with pretty much all of them. And this is the Makeup Forever Aqua Lip in in medium neutral beige. I'm going to have to use this on now. So it just looks like that, a nude lip pencil. So it's a really nice colour, but it just depends how long it'll last for. This is gorgeous packaging, it's metal. This is the Too Faced Le Creme Colour Drenched Lip Cream in Naked Dolly, and it's 1.5 grams. This is gorgeous. And that is a beautiful colour, so obviously very nude. Oh, that is beautiful. Really, really creamy in texture. Gorgeous nude colour. I think that has been my favourite of the bunch so far. Next we have a Bare Minerals Mini Marvelous Moxie Lipstick in Speak Your Mind. This is 1.5 grams. I love these mini lipsticks. They're so cute. Again, you get a lot more product on these than you do that Benefit one. That seems to be the biggest disappointment so far. Oh, that is gorgeous as well. So gorgeous, creamy in texture as well. Really, really nice colour. Next up is the Laura Mercier Lip Glaze in Blush. And this is 2.8 grams. Again, another product that I really want to try for a long time. So that just looks like that, an absolute gorgeous nude lip gloss, really pigmented as well. And that's a really good size, I think. Okay, and last but not least is the Stila Stay All Day Vinyl Lip Gloss in Nude. This is actually what I'm wearing right now. I wore this last night, and it does stay on for a long time. Obviously, after a few hours of drinking, it does wear off, but it did take a few hours of drinking for it to wear off, so I'm very impressed. So there's the colour there, it's extremely pigmented, that was just like one swoop, it stays on all night, I've got it on now, it's absolutely, I think it's probably one of my favourites, it feels really nice on the lips, it does feel a bit sticky, like I can feel it on there, but when I'm wearing long lasting lipstick, you always end up feeling it, and I kind of like the fact that it's sticky, because it reminds me that I'm wearing it, I don't know, but it's I do really, really like it, and like I said, it stayed on all night. So that is all the colours, all of it swatched, and I think for the price and the, the size of most of the products, obviously not the benefit one, the size of the products, it gives you like a really good indication of if you're going to like these products or not, so then go buy more. That's the whole point of this, it's a sample set, and I definitely think it's worth it. I definitely think it will make a, a fantastic Christmas present. And I'm pretty sure, I'm sure I've been told this on Twitter, that you can get this sent to the UK, because I know there's a lot of products on Sephora that don't deliver to the UK, but this is one of them, and if you spend over a certain amount, the delivery is barely anything anyway. So I highly recommend these, and yeah, I'm so glad I bought it for myself, otherwise I'd be asking for it for Christmas. So I hope that review is alright, and I hope you got like a clear look of what it's like, and I hope you will go out and buy it, because I think it's just awesome.